The All England Club raised an eye-watering figure through debenture sales earlier this year. Tennis fans will be forced to shell out a record-breaking figure to attend next year's Wimbledon final after the All England Club, AELTC, raised prices to dizzying new heights. The club is aiming to capitalize on the public's interest in tennis, which remains sky-high despite Andy Murray, Roger Federer, and Serena Williams retiring in recent years. A staggering 2005-20 debentures of guaranteed center court tickets for every year between 2026 and 2030 were sold earlier this year at $116,000 each. The same ticket would have set fans back $63 at the turn of the millennium, $100 in 2009, and two satbaos only six years ago. It is also up $40 from last year's singles final price. Extortionate financial commitments have not deterred supporters from registering their interest in attending next year's tournament. The AELTC announced earlier this week that a record number of public ballot applications were received for a third consecutive year. Standard center court seats on the opening day have been raised from $90 to $105, while grounds passes for the outside courts are still $30 each for the first eight days. An AELTC spokesperson said, very careful consideration is given when setting ticket prices for the championships, with the greatest price increase applied to premium seats on center court and no one court. 20% of all tickets have had prices frozen at 2024 levels, including grounds passes. The Wimbledon public ballot for the championships 2025 closed last week, and we were very pleased to receive a record number of applications, including strong interest from fans in the U.S., Italy, Ireland, and Germany.